it's been 15 months ago since we uh, um, released uh, our plans to build uh, council houses uh, in the city of Birmingham. Not just one or two, but hundreds. Uh, and it's been uh, 15 months since I said that we would uh, have a target of 500 a year. Well, of course, as you know, today was a momentous day. Uh, handed the keys over to two of our new tenants, the first two in our 500. They're family houses, they're three and four bedroom houses, where um, the, new, the new tenants in these new homes uh, were tenants before. They had smaller properties. So now we've got a smaller property, which is available to a smaller family while we're housing these. So it's a win-win situation. But I think more importantly today, what we have proved is we have a revival in municipal responsibility. And that means providing more homes for our people of the city of Birmingham. I mean, let's face it, we haven't done this for 30 years. It was started uh, at the beginning of the century, uh, or should I say the, the, the end of the last century, by the Chamberlain family. Right. In, the, in the 2010, we were actually reviving that municipal uh, uh, responsibility. And we, we're aiming to make things much better, uh, much pleasanter, uh, for the people of Birmingham. It's not easy, but you see, whilst we're doing this, we're also continuing to renovate our older stock so that they will be suitable, they will meet uh, um, a decent home standard. I'm so excited and I'm just looking forward to enjoying being a family, being in a house basically, and enjoying the house, which I've never been able to do because of my current property. Uh, my current property is a three bedroom property, but <clears throat> it's got really tiny space where, I mean, in one room there was myself and my husband and my daughter because I had to move her in. And it wasn't, it was just everyone was on top of each other. There was no opportunity to enjoy the home. It was just trying to move everyone around. How much have you are there? Six. Because it's myself and my husband, I've got three kids and two boys, my two boys have both got special needs. Um, and then I've got my husband's auntie, she's 78, so it was very difficult. Um, so I can't remember enjoying it. The house actually caused a lot of stress with trying to deal with everyone's needs and demands and it being such a tiny space. Well, I think we're leading the country. We're leading the country on, on, on our decent home programme. We're leading the country on, on, on our... Um, uh, uh, repairs and maintenance uh, and improvement. We're leading the country on building retirement villages. We're leading the country on, on bringing some of our uh, um, non-traditional concrete homes back into use in reinstating them. And of course, we're leading the country by building hundreds of new council homes for our people of the city.